the vehicle with the license plate WFK309. Yeah. You've, uh, left your lights on. How do you know that's a truck? Well, because he it. says it's a truck. There's, and... there's wheels on it. Yeah. Oh, okay. I kind of see it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I know what kind of car that is, Jared. What, what kind of car? It's a Ford Rustang. <laughs> That's, that's pretty good. If you want to see us get this board out of the river today, I suggest you stay tuned. Well, this is the scene of Jared. Uh, the scene of Jared is amazing, and I have some really incredible news. Dive right in scuba. Here's the thing, today they are our sponsor, our brand new sponsor, because they fixed not one, not two, but three dry suits for me. The other nice thing I like for what Dive Riding and Scuba did, check this out Tatum, I now have, I didn't have this before, I was afraid to always wear this dry suit, but now I have a pea zipper, I'm no longer afraid to be in my dry suit. <laughs> Jump online, they have an incredible store, knowledgeable staff, and they want to be your local dive shop if you don't already have one. Check out DiveRightInScuba.com in the link description. I hear yesterday was a special day for you. It was, it was my it was birthday. birthday. Congratulations. 44 years old I am. So we've done a bunch of these ex expeditions already. We always seem to come up short in one area. So today, I'm giving you your own full sandwich. What? I'm not gonna share mine with you anymore. You get your, your own sandwich. Congratulations now, and happy birthday. Now is this a birthday sandwich or is this an every time thing now? It's more of a lunchtime sandwich. I wouldn't eat it now. <laughs> Yeah, but. Yeah, save some for your cameraman. Here's the thing though. I'll share 30% with you. I'm a grazer. You put food in front of me, it doesn't last very long. So Tatum, what Scott's doing right now is he's never been in this section of the river before. He's got the side scan sonar, and so what we're doing is I'm showing him where that old mill location is at. There's an old pier that's here. And oh, I see you, the pier. Yeah, and Huge if you look, pier. there's a truck down there as well. Oh, Wait. is it right off the left? It's just off the pier, right? Yeah, yeah. Yep, there's the truck right there. You can see the shadow on it. Yep. And then later on this week, we're actually going to go for that truck. So, if you've not already subscribed, what should you be doing? Maybe you should subscribe, so that way you can see that truck video later on. This boat ramp right here is where back in 92 or 97, they pulled out 22 vehicles all in one day. Come in close, Tatum, on that one. Cool. Can you see that that's definitely a car? Do you see it this time? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like a little sedan. Yep. So now that we've identified another car on side scan, we're gonna go check that one out later on this afternoon. Not part of this video. So like I said, you gotta come back because we're gonna find out what kind of car it is. Scott's going to uh, mark the excursion today. Not the Explorer, we're going for the single excursion. If you find the Explorer, skip it. Let's go get ourselves a, a, an SUV today, Tatum. See you later. So what Scott likes to do is he likes to move his uh, boat and his anchor line over and kind of fasten it right on our target. And I see that it's moving, so I he might already have uh, the excursion down there. Right now we're at 15 feet. We should be heading down to about 30 to 35. All right, I'm at 33 feet. I don't see Scott anywhere. I don't see the vehicle anywhere. I didn't take a reading before I left. Oh, hey fish, what's up? You know where Scott's at? Can you help me out? Oh, there's a bicycle. Or something there. What is that? Oh, that's a big anchor. Okay. I found a car. Oh, what is this one? I guess we'll go for this one. Oh, there's another one. What are these two? Huh. I don't even know. What'd you find? Uh, what the heck? Well, in the meantime, let's go ahead and hook this up. 
hope that Scott will be able to find me. Let's go around the wheel here, around the axle. Actually, I don't think we want to go around there. This one's a little bit different. Let's go around the frame on this one right here. Alright, there we go. Beautiful. Nice and tight. I still don't see Scott yet. At this point in time, oh, there's Scott. That's awesome. So do you have ears on me? Okay, that's great. Do you have your marker? Go ahead and mark it. And then uh, I'm gonna go get uh, a lift bag and a tank. And then uh, you come get another bag as well. Did you find it? Well, we we're going after the Explorer that's on the Honda. Okay. We can't find the other one yet. So maybe we'll run across it later. Yeah. Where's the marker? Scott's working on the marker. All right. So we've got a bag from Tatum. Thank you very much, Tatum. All right, Scott, I'm right over the uh, mark coming down now. Well, you have the bag upside down. There you go. That's beautiful. Hold it tight. Okay, we're applying some air now. Air is going in. Oh, oh, our upper valve is open. No, turn it off. Woo! All right, I got it. There we go. Now it might work. Uh, uh, you're going up to for another bag? Got it. Woo! See that pop? It's adjusting on the frame there. Oh, it's picking the car up. Woo! One bag is only. Woo! Oh, that's crazy. It's already picking the side of the car up. That looks good. Let's go see. It probably just popped off the Honda. That's good news. Don't swim underneath of it. That's always a good thing. We're only down at 16 feet. That's crazy. Scott's back. All right, let's go ahead and hook the bag up. Thank you. All right, bag is hooked up. Things are tight. Let's move the uh, tank over. You want to hold that? I got the tank. Over you. All right, where is the hose? Come on, hose. Boat and hose, boat and hose, where are the hose? turn the tank on make sure the chain is still attached nice and tight here it is we're gonna go ahead and apply some air all right the air is going in all right down to 1200 
pounds of pressure in my tank. Oh, that one's open too. Whew. Huh. There we go. Now it works. Yeah, I'm making a habit of leaving my uh, valves open after I'm done cleaning them. Make sure you come off to the side just in case it does lift up with uh, just two bags today. I don't think that it will, but it's looking pretty good right now. It's not full of silt, so it, it might actually lift with two bags. Oh, it's going up. It's up! It's up with two bags! Woo! Look at that! Hey, good news is, it's floating with only two bags. I know, that's strange. We'll hook it up and then we'll uh, flip it right side up. I don't even think this is an SUV. I think this is a car. It is a car. It's a Ford car of some sort. Huh. It was weird when I was down there, I looked in the glove box, in the manual. Guess what was on page four and five? No. Bus and train schedule for the Ford. That one's hooked up. That's why it lifted so easy. Because it's a car. What we're going to try to do is flip this car on its wheels. We still don't know what it is, do we? Ford something. Explorers don't have wings, bro. <laughs> they don't have wings on the back. That's a car. I don't even know what to say. It, it's a Ford, but it's not the Ford that we thought it was. You know what Ford stands for? Uh, found on road dead. Float or return daily. He's a scuba diver. If you're a Chevy fan, leave a thumbs up. If you're a Ford fan, <laughs> exactly. we found your car. The other one is a Honda. I know for a fact that that You put money on this one? Did you see the badge? Unless somebody I took a Nissan and put a Honda badge on, I touched the Honda badge. You know what they call a oh. Ford at the top of a hill? A miracle! <laughs> oh, oh wait. that was a good one. You know how we can double the double the value of that car right there? How's that? Fill it full of gas. <laughs> <laughs> if you have any Ford jokes of your own, leave them in the comments section below. Oh, I got nothing against Ford. I stuck. I think that's as far as it's going. Oh. Oh, that's the steering wheel. That is so cool. We got Brandon back with Elite Towing. Look, we should come up here so we can actually see the, your uh, big old logo over here. But now it's noisy next to the truck. So let's tell, tell them all about Elite Towing. These guys are amazing. This is Brandon here. They come out here on their own dime to help us clean up the environment. Use the discount code YouTube you, with this phone number down below or go to their website. Just let them know you saw us on Adventures of Purpose because they're going to give you 10% off for anything that you need here in the Portland Metro Vancouver market. Slow down that gas flow leaking out. Why don't that thing fall on you, buddy? Are you buddy? sure it's a Toyota? No, they think it's a Ford. That's Ford. Oh, Ford? Yeah. I think it's a uh, Fiesta. Whoa! Look at that. Escort. It's an Escort. Have you ever had an Escort before, Scott? No, never. Look, Brandon's trying to put the car on the uh, deck. You gotta move. Is it on it? <laughs> yeah. Take a ride? Lock it, Scott. Oh shoot, I forgot the lock. Yeah. What about the keys? Are they gonna in the ignition? That's the lock. No, it just turns. Yeah, it's not even hooked up. Anything in the glove box? Uh let's see. <laughs> nope. What about the uh, trunk oh, here latch? <laughs> Is it gonna open? Nope. I think it's a hatchback. 
Anything in the back? Just a skeleton. You know why, uh, you know, people are like, oh, why are you guys always so excited to find a body? Oh, look at this, bonus. Oh, look at that. What year does it expire? Oh, four. There you go. Scott. Yeah. I need your help. Yeah. So after we check the uh, oil on this, yeah. we just have to change the plugs and then uh, it should fire right up. Yeah, you you might want to get some of the seaweed sponge stuff off of the here here and there, and then I like to kind of Brent, polish up the life? the intakes. That's just a personal preference. Yeah. Uh, looks like we, one good thing, Jared, is this this fluid level is is correct. It's oh, that's full. Good. That's good. What about the brake fluid? Uh, looks like the well, let's see. That's uh, radiator. Looks like it's. Uh, uh, you know that that doesn't look good to me. No, maybe we just flush the radiator. Yeah. How about the uh, brake fluid? Uh, brake fluid level looks uh looks pretty per per perfect. Oh, it does have a battery. Yeah, battery still in the, there. The I haven't turned the key yet. Try it. Oh, yeah, it's a little wedged. Oh, uh, well, you have to put it in park. Oh, right, yeah, right now it's in uh, neutral. Yeah. Oh, oh, e brake. What's that? Oh, it's a seatbelt. You know, it'd be kind of fun to look in that, uh... Hey guys, book. you get in it? We need like a little... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh that for the glove box? Yeah. It's like... It's like... Okay, yes, officer, I'll get my license and registration. Just a second. You're not, you're not very good at getting in there. Oh, oh! It's not how I would open it. Oh, yeah! It looks like you've got absolutely nothing, but you never know until you look. Ooh. Nothing? Oh, I don't think so. Hey, Brandon! Later, later. Bye-bye.